Well, Asbel, have you learned anything? Mr. President, I think we may be able to help you fix your Valcanus Creus. All right, fair enough. What are you planning? Please look at this diagram. It's from a friend of mine who's extremely knowledgeable about such things. She said she'd be willing to investigate. Hmm. It seems you've been holding a trump card this whole time. Well, you're right. Our country's Valcanus Creus has been experiencing severe problems as of late. When we sent a research team to investigate, they found a Marcian ruins at its base. A Marcian ruins? You're familiar with the Amarsians, the mysterious people who left ruins all over the world. We don't know if these ruins are connected to the Valcanus somehow, but it's possible. I'm telling you this because I'm interested in what your learned friend might think. Our scientists have precious little insight when it comes to Amarsia. It would be most helpful if she could take a look. If we agree to investigate the problem, will you let Hubert stay? Investigation will not be enough, I'm afraid. You will need to fix the problem altogether. Okay, I'll take my friend to see the Valcanus Creus. It's located in the desert west of here, surrounded by some ruins. I will give you an ID card as well. We don't allow regular citizens to approach the Valcanus, you see. Thank you, and good luck. Sorry to keep you waiting. How did it go? Well, he was very interested in Pascal's diagram. He wants us to investigate the Valcanus as soon as we can. Sweet! Thanks, Pascal. With a little luck, I think we might be able to save Hubert now. Hey, no sweat. I'd do anything to see Strata's Valcanus Creus. So where is it? Inside some ruins, in the desert west of here. All right, let's get going. I can't even sweat anymore. Asbel, are you okay? You're not dehydrated, are you? It's not that. It's the water, Elith. Pascal? Pascal, stay with us. Huh? Uh-huh. Yes, I see. Is she all right? She says it's so hot she doesn't feel like talking. <laughs> she could at least finish what she was saying. On top of that, she says the reason you're not sweating is because there isn't any water Elith in the air. Okay, let's do this! Now! There! Right. Okay! Death by moonlight! Your sword skills are amazing! Thanks! I'll use them to protect us all! Oh! 
Okay, let's do this. I didn't fight all those enemies for nothing. We're ready for battle. Yeah. No no way. Way. It's, it's over. Rip to pieces. Stampede strike. No strike. Okay. Die. Vanish. Die. Break. Break. Fall. Are you all right, Sharia? Can you stand? If only Asbel could be this kind. I can't lose! Huh. Now! Be gone! Oh, okay. Die! Break! Let's go! Vanish! Freeze! Hold on a minute! Let's go! Freeze! Right. Oh. Bad, don't you think? Pretty, but the win is a win. think oh I know it you are late
were people, but it's just sand that hardened into a human-like shape. With so few people in this area, there's no one around to knock them over. Huh, interesting. Why do you think the Amarsians put a Valcanus in the middle of the desert like this? Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. 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 Pascal says you actually have it backwards. She says the Valcanus Creus likely turned this place into a desert. Why are you speaking for her, Sheria? She says it's a pain to talk in this heat. Hmm? for nothing. for nothing. Falconist should be here somewhere. 